So I can publicly say that I was kind of talked into buying a home that I probably really wasn't ready for. Now, when you think of home ownership, you think of freedom and nobody telling you to get out and you can do what you want to. And you ain't paying rent, so therefore you're not wasting money. Take your time buying a house. Take your time getting a mortgage. Take your time deciding where you want to spend at least minimum the next five to 10 years of your life. I kind of feel like as soon as I bought the place that I currently reside in, everything went wrong. I had no idea how much an AC cost to repair it because every time my AC went out, I called my landlord and he took care of it. I had no idea that when the AC drip inside your house, you got to call an AC guy and they might charge you $1,500 to stop the drip, stop the drip, stop the drip. The last time anything dripped around me, I took two pills for three days and the drip was gone. I was was a phenomenal well-paid renter when anything went wrong with my washer and dryer I called the landlord and he replaced the washer and dryer immediately I fixed my washer about four times and I fixed that dryer more times and I got fingers and toes on my body I ain't buying a damn thing because it's too expensive before buying this beautiful immaculate small ass house my shower had more pressure than R. Kelly peeing in a video. Soon as I signed those damn papers, the water pressure went to hell. You can teardrop harder than the water pressure came from my shower head. But I had to go buy new shower heads and clean those out and then get my pipes fixed. Before owning this home, when the lawn man came and cut the grass around the house and the rock hit the window, I didn't care. If it cracked the screen on my lanai, I didn't give a damn because my landlord had to pay to get that fixed. Now every time I hear any kind of lawnmower outside, I go wash them with the evil eye. They calling me Kevin and Stella Karen out here. I am the black male version of Karen because if anything get torn down out here, I want to speak to the manager. Being a homeowner is worrisome. Being a homeowner is like having another child. If you ain't never had a child, it's becoming having a child because it's expensive. Every day in break, every storm that come, you get paranoid because you don't want them to be damaged because the insurance companies be tripping. And damn it, if you miss two or three payments, the mortgage companies send you letters with your blood in it. I miss being a renter sometimes.